All right, I just wanted to make this quick tutorial for you on how to link your Facebook to your Beacons page. So this one won't be too long. I'm gonna get right into it. Um, as you've probably seen by my other videos, which I will have the link to in the description of this video on how to get started, on how to link your Instagram. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to link your Facebook page to your Beacons page. So let's get right down to it. So this is the back end of my Beacons page, okay? And just to give you an idea on what it looks like, here's what the Beacons page looks like. So it's a mobile website. It is a link in bio tool that you can use that in my opinion is far superior than any link in bio tool that's available in the marketplace today. And I don't work for Beacons, big disclaimer. I'm just a fan of it. And I like coaching people. I like working with creators, influencers, and entrepreneurs just to be able to put this together. So this is my Beacons page and this is the back end of it. So if you have your setup, this is how you're going to do it. So you're going to click on header. Okay. And then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down and this is where you're going to connect your other social media platforms. So this one right here, um, you see I have my YouTube connected. Now, the only reason why I just have my YouTube connected because at this current time, that's where I'm trying to drive traffic to, as well as give people the option to take advantage of some other resources that I have. So I have other videos on this channel and I also have a publication that talks about LinkedIn bio marketing specifically. So I do have that, but I only have my YouTube hooked up to my beacons page uh, for right now because that's what i'm trying to do is trying to direct people here for the tutorials and for some training so so uh, i also brought up my uh, facebook account as well uh just so you have an idea on um what what my facebook account looks like so you can find me anytime on facebook at tim.leakash okay so for this right here you see how at the top screen uh facebook gives you a url um, so yours uh, may be obviously different than mine, but mine says Tim.leecash, right? I just like aesthetically how it looks when I put the dot in there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight it and I'm going to control C, I'm going to copy it. And then in the Facebook field, I am going to uh, highlight the field and then I'm going to control V and I'm going to put the link in there. So as you can see, it's changed from just having the YouTube button to now having the Facebook button as well. So if I were to go to my actual page that I haven't refreshed yet, and this is how you can check your work, is you can bring up um, your Beacons page and just verify your changes. So what you can do with this, and I can just click on the refresh button, right? And then once I click on the refresh button, there it is right there, and you can always test it as well. So you can click on it and just see where it takes you, right? So if it takes me to my Facebook page, then success, right? So you'll see also on my Facebook page, I have my Beacons link down in my bio on Facebook as well. I can certainly go into how I did that on another video, but I just wanted to show you in this video how you link your Facebook account to your Beacons page if you have a, one already started. Now, if you don't have one started, you can certainly head to mine, which I will put the link um, to mine in the description of this video. And you can click on it and you will also get a $20 credit to be able to use towards um, the, entrepreneur, the entrepreneur plan. Now, there is a creator plan, which is free, which is more than enough to get started with. And then there's the entrepreneur plan, which is $10 a month. And the coupon that I give you is uh, worth $20 towards that. So you're welcome to start one for free. You can watch the tutorials on how I help you get started for free. And you can follow along that way. Um, so if you're not on there and you've been curious about it, you've heard people uh, have it, you've seen it maybe on TikTok, primarily a lot of people on TikTok use it. A lot of big, big influencers do use the tool. And if you haven't got set up, you can certainly click on the link in the description of this video and you can get started today and you can watch my videos. Now, if you already have one set up and you're just wondering how it all works and how you connect everything, that's what this video was for, is how to connect your Facebook page to your Beacons page. I have another video where I show you how to link your Instagram 
And as this channel progresses, I'm going to issue more tutorials on how to link everything up. And by the time maybe you're watching this, I might have those tutorials already. So uh, consider subscribing to my channel and um, hit the notification bell. So when I do uh, release another tutorial, you'll be notified of it. Uh, but for today on this video, that's how you hook your, uh, I guess, link your Facebook page to your Beacons page. So hopefully that was helpful for you today. You go to your main Facebook page, you click copy, you paste it into the Facebook field on Beacons page, you test it out, you connect it, and you're all set. So hopefully that was helpful for you today. And uh, as always, I will uh, see you at the next one. Bye for now.